So, with everything that's been happening in the world over the last few years, the question many travellers ask is, where is the best place to go in 2022? Hua Hin is a highly underrated region of Thailand. This area has a somewhat Bangkok vibe due to its location. In fact, it's just over 2.5 hours away from the capital. One of the reasons that this location has made our list of the best places to go in 2022 is because Hua Hin is a super cheap place to live on average. Hua Hin is also a great base as you could travel to other parts of Thailand very easily. So it does have that accessibility benefit due to its geographical location. Cebu is a well-known location with the expat community, and in addition, it's also very popular with the Western expats as well as the Asian expats. The city and surrounding cities are fantastic places for many different types of travelers, including entrepreneurs who are looking to start a business. Costs can be slightly higher if you're staying in the downtown area of Cebu City, but the city does offer an excellent quality of life for foreigners in 2022. If you are looking for a beach life in a modern and vibrant city, you may wish to check out Da Nang. The costs for everyday items are pretty average for Da Nang, but where you can really save money is through real estate. It's not too difficult to find a nice small apartment, sometimes even under $200 a month. For those who enjoy a fish heavy diet, you will find multiple options all across the city at very affordable prices. The area itself is not a city but instead a province, the location of which is on the border of Thailand and Cambodia. Trait has a beautiful beach side and the cost of living is fantastic. So if you are in the area of Thailand or you're planning to take a trip in 2022, this is a perfect getaway location outside of the main cities. If you are looking to enjoy life and explore, then Davao is perfect. There are several wine bars and a few clubs in this area, but nothing too crazy. Davao has a lot to offer travelers, and the locals are very friendly and welcoming to foreigners. You may find that many expats and retirees have made Davao City their home. Ilo Ilo City is one of those areas that many people know about but not many have travelled to. The cost of living is similar to that of Davao more or less with a few exceptions, meaning that you'll need around about $1,000 a month to live comfortably, but if you really want to live well, it's best to budget at least $1,500 to $2,000 a month. But a budget of $1,500 and above is not necessary, but it does allow you to have a little bit more freedom when living in cities such as Ilo Ilo or Davao. Ilo Ilo is most known for its churches and landmarks which date back hundreds of years. There is also a large food community in this area. Feel free to check out our full guide on YouTube for some extra data. Many people have lived and travelled to Chiang Mai, but not many have visited Chiang Rai. Both cities are very similar, but Chiang Rai is much smaller and less crowded. Chiang Mai and Chiang Rai are known to be very cost effective for foreigners. Chiang Mai has many options which provide more choices to foreigners, but at the same time, Chiang Rai also has a wide range of entertainment, housing and lifestyle options. Some foreigners can live very comfortably on less than $800 a month in Chiang Rai as it's a super cheap place for the average expat. 